Hey guys, so what up here and welcome back to NASCAR Dirt Daytona Crew part number 58. We're still in the trucks and modifies and we're kind of going back to what it used to kind of be with doing a modified and a truck race in this part. I am, a fun fact, uh, as I'm recording this, it's what, 4.30 in the morning and um, this is like the day after I, I uh, uploaded the, uh, the, the most recent vlog and I was just really just anxious and curious what people would think of my situation and I really don't want people to think I'm like a scumbag, so... Um, I just I didn't want to record. I wasn't feeling the best, so that's why I'm recording so late. So anyways, we're going to be going to Welch Valley. Yeah, Welch Valley uh, Racing. So, yeah, let's uh, let's win there and win the truck race too. Up the final corner, we'll see what this lap time is. The pull lap is around a 114, so we'll see. And 114.8, so, damn, we're like still like seven tenths of a second off the pole, I think. That's crazy. Okay, 14-6, so, okay, I was, I was a little bit wrong, I was a little bit off, but I guess second place, so that's good. So normally we always do good here and win, so I'm expecting that, so we'll just, we'll just see what we can do. And um, these races don't really mean much anymore, but it's still nice to get that extra money here and there, so that's why I'm still doing them. And here we go, and we're starting on the inside, which is the preferred lane in the first corner, so that's weird that they placed me there. I don't know. It's just, it's just, it's just interesting. Oh my good lord, that was, that was sideways. But that's the, the amount of fun we're gonna have because I just got the lead and we're just gonna pull away now. Out the final corner, um, nothing happened. <laughs> Once I got the lead, it was yeah, just like I said, just chill. So we won that by like six plus seconds, and let's just let's just move on to the truck race. I get thirty nine thousand, so another uh, good paying race for modified standards. So. Let's just move on to the truck race. I don't know what the truck race will be doing. Like, is I don't I don't know. But if I can remember correctly, we're nearing the end of the season. I think we only have like maybe four races left. I think. So we'll just see. So we'll go to September and what is it here? Okay, Richmond. Okay, Richmond. And it's on a Thursday, so I guess. Uh, I guess before the trucks went to Bristol. They ran at Richmond on a Thursday, so that's interesting. If that's uh, true to the 2002 schedule, so I learned something today. Off well, turn four, we'll see what this time is. I don't know what the pull lap was, so I'm hoping it was just a decent lap. And it's a 22.5, and that should be a easily a top five run, I think. I'm not. Oh, oh. it looks like it, and it's a pull. Okay, I'll take it. It was only by about tenth over Setzer, so that's nice to see. And we're starting. On the inside, we're in clean air. And we'll just get off to a great start, pull away, and it should be a chill sort of race, I hope. I hope, as long as we don't hit the apron. That's been a problem for me in the last few races in the truck series. And we don't get off to a very good start. Okay. I was on the, I was on the gas, I just, just truck didn't want to go. So, let's just keep it to the bottom. Laps. So, we got 24, and ooh, I don't want to dive it in there. Just, just take your time, okay? It's a, it's a long race. So, okay, we got 11 laps, so we'll pit around lap 9, I guess. So I guess that's our plan. Now, if I remember correctly, the last time I was here in our first, in our last Richmond truck race, the race was, went very odd because, like, half, like, there was, like, half the field that pitted twice and the other half, like, pitted once. So I don't understand that. You don't have to do that. When you go down pit road, you pretty much are good on fuel all the way to the end, no matter what really you do. Most people pit it from like lap 9 to 12 or 13, so they could have made it to the end easily. So I don't understand that. And speaking of, of all that sort of stuff, we're actually having a really difficult time trying to run down sets there. I like, I just simply Carlo. cannot. <gasps> okay, I just simply can't catch them. I mean, we're kind of there, but we're not really catching them, which is scary because once we move up to the Cup Series, the trucks, uh, the truck, trucks. <laughs> like, why do I keep saying that? The, the field gets a lot tougher, so if they're already decently tough here as it is now, then oh boy, I'm scared when they when I when they get even harder, because then there's no way I'm gonna get 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 a win here. At least I would think so. I don't know, but we're we're kind of reeling them in. We finally got the groove down. We're just kind of getting used to this. And go through the corner, get to his inside, keep it to the bottom, and GG Setzer, you put up a pretty good fight, but now it's my race. I'm head down Piro this lap. We've gapped Setzer by a pretty decent amount so far, so let's just kind of slow down. 
Don't know what the speed is. Um, I guess 45, 35? I don't know. I keep thinking it's Dover. I don't know. Well, I mean, I could have been a lot better, but I weak sauced it in there. So, yeah, we'll put in that. Two tires and that repair damage will be in and out. And no trucks down pit road. <laughs> and we should be good to go to the end. It should be about an eight second stop, roughly. Roughly. <laughs> roughly, I guess. I don't know if I was seeing things, but it looks like the truck was slightly sliding to the left. I feel like I'm just imagining things. And I don't. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Schrader, I didn't know what he was going to do. Now, see, you may think that, hey, you're recording this at like almost 4 30 in the morning. Doesn't that mean you haven't slept yet? Well, this, the thing is, I. I just like woke up recently, so it's still it's like it's like the it's just it's just not like that for me. It just see that see that's that's the pro of doing YouTube is just you could kind of just wake up whenever you want and sleep whenever you want. But the con is your sleep pattern is completely just just not normal, and it's uh, it can be a bad thing at times. But as I'm talking about that, we get by Setzer. I think that was down there, leaving Piro, so we should... <gasps> oh my god! God damn, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Normally they kind of go down, they stay down low before they pit. They don't just swerve to the left. Oh my god, and that really yeah, fucked up our truck. Damn, that sucks. <sighs> you know, I just, I can't have nice things. Okay, never mind, we got the lead. <laughs> and Setzer is just barely behind me now. I'm, I'm a little bit worried because I don't know if our truck's gonna have the, the speed it once had, because I mean, that damage is a, it's a pretty good amount on the front. So, I don't know. We'll just see. So, I mean, we got lap traffic, so I could maybe help us in the, in the long run, but yeah, I, I could feel it kind of pushing a little bit, so I think the aerodynamics are a little bit messed up. We got 10 to go at least, so. I don't know, we got a bunch of lap traffic, so I think we should be fine. We're actually losing ground a little bit, so that's a little scary. God, I just... Now, I tell you, this game is just, it just has those elements of Pete Evolution and Heat 2 in it. Just It has those elements, and it was the, the precursor to all of it, so I shouldn't be shocked. And why did I door him on the straightaway? Oh my god, he is actually catching me. Holy shit. Okay, let, let, I'm going to focus now. Five more laps to go in the race, and Setzer is still there. I mean, he, I gotta give him props, because, I mean, he's getting around lap traffic very, very well. And I'm just, I've been as, like, two, but, yeah, the truck's just, it's, it's crazy, though, how much that little bit of damage. Well, actually, it wasn't a little bit of damage. It was a, it was a pretty hefty uh, smash at the side of my truck, so. Yeah, we're, we're just barely keeping him at bay. This thing is long. That's I think it's just because I'm kind of keeping my line and I'm getting used to the track. I'm kind of able to kind of stabilize it. Well, um, bumping a truck doesn't help matters, and that probably damaged the front end even more now. So that's just you know, absolutely lovely. Oh my God, Setzer is there again. <laughs> oh my God, just that's like what the third truck race in a row where it's been like a little bit more interesting than when I was honestly expecting. I mean, look at this game throwing me curveballs. Oh my god, they're, they're, they're so fucking slow. Holy shit, these lap trucks. I, not even season one me in the truck series was that slow here. Okay, there we go. We get by... I, I long got by him. Holy shit. Okay. Sets are still there, only three tenths back. But I think as long as we just kind of hold the bottom, should be fine. And we actually got them a little bit there. Are we losing him on the, on the streets, or... No, not really. Oh my fucking god, these lap trucks. Get out of the fucking way! Ooh, what the, what the second... It's the 205 truck! The same... I think the same truck that screwed me over a long time ago in Michigan. In season... The first season. Oh my god, Setzer is there, and I'm fucking pushing up the track. No! No, 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 no. I'm not gonna lose this fucking race. There's just lap traffic everywhere. Oh my god! The fucking lap traffic. That's ridiculous. Son of a bitch! God, these fucking idiots just get out of the fucking way! What a bunch of scrubs! I, 
I, I, I was gonna stay to the outside because I thought they would all just, 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 they, they did. They certainly, but the whole, there was three or three fucking five. And we get 104,000, so that's still a good amount, but I'm imagining, yeah, the expenses is, uh, well, the repair fees weren't too bad. I thought it would be a lot more. But yeah, that, God, that just sucks. I, <laughs> God, I, well, we still have the title pretty much on lockdown, I think, so we're good on that front. And Setzer is, what, our third different winner in the season, so that's just absolutely just insane. <laughs> so, yeah, we're just, we're, we're doing fine. It's just, I hate losing races to lap traffic. God, it just, whatever. A big shout out to my tier 3 Patreon supporters, the Down Reynolds, Roland Hopper, Weather Bros, Kamikaze Games, Ryan Lazar, and Michael Harrison, Day 500 Champ 15, Jeff Gordon, Zach Rogers, Racing News Now, Alan Gray, Matthew Murray, Stephen Willey, and ATF Gaming for a donation. Again, I can't thank you guys enough for your contribution and support to the channel. It does mean a lot to me, and I seriously, I seriously can't thank you guys' for help along the way. I'll see you all next part for, I think, more of the same, and hey, we got over a million dollars in the available funds section, so yay. Yeah. It'll be trucks and modified, and then after that we'll have trucks and modified, <laughs> and then trucks and trucks, and then we'll go to race f the, the homestead race, and then we'll do like the postseason stuff. So yeah, that's uh, that was it. I, 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 this game, just when I think I could just completely just 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 destroy the field, it just has to be challenging. Good on you, game. So. I'll see you all next part, and I'll see you all later, and as always, have a good day, everyone.